Yeah, all right. You've got a screw loose. <laughs> That'll go under the tire, knowing yeah, me, won't it? That'll be the tire bag. Okay, so this is the second part of the Citroen Berlingo build, isn't it, Ryan? Yeah. yeah Ryan's been busy building his bed. Part one. Part one. That's first part. Oh yeah, first part. Yeah. Second part's rent to be screwed together. He's bought a saw, so he's happy. I got all excited. Yes. So you want to talk us through what you've done then, Ryan? Uh, so just two by one timber, just cut it down. Just got some angle brackets. Dead easy screwed together uh, it's going to be a very how should we put short bed it's not very high no because the problem with the caddies we found with the build from van furniture yeah it looked great but when you actually sat on it you were hitting your head on the yeah, roof it was weren't almost you? twice the height of that it was a bit rubbish really wasn't it yeah you couldn't sit up in it no it was just it didn't work that's why we've opted the it wasn't their fault obviously it just it was just that's just how they've done it yeah so We've opted for our own, so... Lower. That's the first base. Obviously, that's going to go on top of here. And then, obviously, we've got a cushion on top. We are having a pull-out bit, which is another 16-inch, so it can need just shorter this. Uh, which is obviously a bit shorter. It's a bit narrower there than that bit, so that it's a bit more comfortable for your legs. And then we're just toying with an idea of a separate box. So we might have another separate box here, so it welcomes you into the van instead of just being boxed off a bit of an angle. So you actually open the door and it wel it pushes you towards the van, if that makes sense, instead of just a box. And then obviously <clears throat> the second bit will slide out to here, which makes the bed a little bit bigger as well yeah. for Ryan's hair when it needs to come over here. Give or take, it's going to be that line Yeah, you can just see on the floor. So that's where it's going to come to. Yeah. And so, as always, we've been a bit delayed, haven't we? Yeah, we've been busy. Because we still need to pay the rent for this place and we've still got jobs. What time is it, Ryan? It is now 25 to 6. 25 to 6. I've just finished work. Ryan's had a rare day off. And I think I've got COVID. That's nice. But we're still going to crack on. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'll be ill tomorrow. Yeah, Great. we'll probably see you in about three months <laughs> in the next update. Bye for now. All right, come take a seat, Lewis. Let's see if it survives. What if I fall through? <laughs> We're going again. Yeah, but you weigh 20 stone. You should be trying this, not me. Get on it. Right. When the van's rocking, don't come knocking. <laughs> That's all right, that Ryan. Very sturdy. Should I try lying down? Yeah. It's a bit creaky. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's just the makeshift. I might, to, I might go to sleep though. It's just the makeshift slats that we've made for now. Look at that, loads of room. Is there? I might yeah. end. Just. So I've your foot. Wear boots on, though. Yeah, yeah, you're just on the edge there. Just put your head down. Not that much. <laughs> yeah, you're literally right on. That is. Well, you've got a pillow, haven't you? Yeah. And then there's going to be. So obviously, this is where the bed will end towards the door. Mm. You're going to have, give or take, six inches or so before you reach the actual door. So you've got a bit of space for your feet. Shit, sorry. <laughs> Trying to swear. So we put the top on the bed. We can actually take these off so you know, so you can see. So that is the basic structure. Obviously, we're going to have some slats. We've got the extension to build that will slide in and out. That's what the remaining wood's for. So we it are. It doesn't look that much, does it? But it holds no. us. It looks thin at first sight, but when you actually get on it, it's surprisingly strong. All right, finish the rest. Welcome back, guys. Probably been a while since we've actually filmed anything. I just thought I'd give you a quick update, show you whereabouts we're up to. So, to begin with, we have light. So, as you can see, lights are all wired up now you'll just see right in the corner by that button that's the actual remote sensor here we have our remote for various things so we can brighten it up dim it down so that's pretty cool uh obviously all the beds in now just need to put the slats this bit here will be the bit that pulls out 
doing that tonight, so that's going on. Here we have the unit that's now fixed in. We still have a top to put on, which will cover this. Go right to the back, cover all that up. There we have our split relay charger, leisure battery, which I will just come around and show you. So, there's our battery. You'll see this wire here, which will get hidden, goes all the way up, connects to the main starter battery. Here we have our thingy. There's our actual ledger battery charge. We've got a couple of USBs, as well as a 12 volt plug there. That's some of the wiring. You'll see some of the connectors and things that will all get boxed in and hidden. You can see all the wires there at the bottom. I'll just show you up top there. That's everything there. That again will all get boxed in and hidden when we're finished. So that's our update. No Lewis tonight, he is he's sunning himself in Italy. Lucky boy. Oh dear, Ryan. How long did you say it was going to take us to do this van? Roughly five weeks. What day is it today? 15th of March. March? May. May. March is when we started. Yes. Hmm, looking good though. Lights are on. Cushions are in. Ryan's mum's done another brilliant job. In fact, let me just close that slidey door. Look at that. Do you want to um, unfold the bed? Unfold the bed. Wrong way around, isn't it? Are they? It's all right. I'll open that door. Just for a Very, very nice. All match up. She's done a brilliant job again, hasn't she? Yeah, it's good. Very good job. Um, yeah. yeah nearly so there, the really, aren't we? Yeah. Bed's nearly done. Not quite finished just yet. Nope. Got some panelling. Which is on here. That, that big board there. Slide this back in. You can see we have a small section which we've cut and placed, so that's what it'll be. So I'll get basically hide all the wood that we've built, just tidy the place up. Yeah, look a bit nicer, won't it? Yeah. So paneling, still haven't boxed our wiring. A bit of a little spice rack you forgot about. Yeah. And then it's there, Ryan, isn't it? Really? Got a Interior, couple of. Yeah. Yeah. We're done. We are deciding. We want to know your opinion. Do we, do we paint the van? Because there is some slight damage. Which is that beforehand. Yes, it wasn't me, honestly. But there is some slight damage and it does. Yeah, that's it. It'd be funny if it came out, wouldn't it? Um, <laughs> just added a new one. Yeah. So do we get it painted, guys? We need to Let us know, because Ryan needs to start saving his pennies if we are. <laughs> So he'll probably be done for next winter, won't it? <laughs> yeah, sometime. Another five months. <laughs> He's going <Months>. grey. <laughs> yeah, but there we are. It's looking bloody good, isn't it, Ryan? Yeah. I'd sleep in there for 10 wasn't, minutes. It wasn't grey when we started. Sorry? It wasn't grey when I started. It's the I know, the I know. It's, it's these LEDs. They're, they're high voltage, aren't they? Oh. So, yeah, the batteries. Did we show them the battery last time? We have, haven't we? It's in the battery. Yeah, it's all under the cushions and stuff like that, so... Hopefully, next video shall be in a couple of weeks. We are sorry about the wait, but as you know, life life gets in the way sometimes, doesn't it? Always in the way. It's either life or Ryan's belly. <laughs> Ciao for now.